One. We're back with WFB NY News. I'm Naya. And I'm Shania. On today's news, we are going to be discussing the meaning of American citizenship. AKA, why don't we have it? In 1864, three years into the war, you would expect for the basic human rights to be given to us after what black people had to experience in this country. Though in the North, we as free blacks are allowed to be more spoken to the abolish of slavery. On the other hand, the Southern free blacks are forced into silence, into the shadows of not having the voice. In the, in the North, we are somewhat allowed to participate in American society. Black men can at least create congregations like churches, school, and monsoons. In some Northern cities, black men who own land, businesses, and homes and pay taxes are allowed to vote in the local election. Some even bring themselves to purchase slaves, mostly to save enslaved families and members. It's crazy, right? Well, it's going on in our country, in our states. African Americans, Americans have to work twice as harder to get anything that they need. This is where the civil rights movement moves into play. This movement started in 1954. The civil rights movement was a struggle for social justice that took a decade long. Black was one of the gain equal rights for everyone. This movement began with one of our Civil rights activist named Rosa Parks was arrested because she didn't stand while choosing to sit where she wanted. That's crazy, right? In 1963, Martin Luther King was arrested for speaking on his rights as a black man and protesting about equal rights. The most important activists that took part of this movement were Martin Luther King Jr., Rosa Parks, Malcolm X, Muhammad Ali, James Baldwin, Bob Dylan, Nina Simone, Dorothy Heights, Gregory Douglas, Harvey Milk, Zach D. La Rocha, Harley Purvet, Jack, Jesse Jackson, etc. These people fought for equal rights for blacks and they, lab they labeled them as monsters and people who were trying to ruin good things. This movement was a mass protection movement. This is against racial segregation and discrimination. Colored people had to struggle to get the rights that they should have had in the first place, which is very bizarre. This is what makes it, it makes it work. And what makes it worse is our country was built on the idea of democracy, a government built by the people for the people and still looks at anyone who isn't a rich white male as a second class citizen. So returning to the question, do you believe free blacks should should be considered citizens during the Civil War time? No. Could every one of us take part in the election? No. Could everyone be assured the rights of a fair trial? Mm -mm. Could we pursue li life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness? No. Well, that's your answer. Thanks for tuning in to YFB New York News. I'm Shania. And I'm Naya. And here's Bob with our evening weather. You used to call me on my. You used to, you used to. The movement started in 1945. The civil rights movement was a struggle for social justice that took a decade long. Black just wanted to gain equal rights for everyone. This movement began when one of our civil rights activists named Rosa Parks was arrested because she didn't stand while choosing to sit where she wanted to sit. That's crazy, right? It was 1954. What did I say? 45. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> oh my god. It's okay, it's okay. We can keep it in there. Okay. 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 And I Jesse Jackson, etc. And Polly Perrett. She's about to say it. I skipped over for Period. Yeah, I was about to say it. I skipped like, over for a reason. So period. <laughs> <laughs> and do you believe free, free blacks could be considered citizens during Civil War times? Could everyone of us take place in an election? Could everyone be insured the right to appear? No. <laughs> I didn't even get there yet. <laughs> Oh, you no, I guess every time she, box, you no, I guess I every time she asks a question, you could be like, no, 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 no. no. Can everyone, can every one of us take part in an election? Hell no. I mean, no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. He said, hell no. <laughs> okay, we're going to try it again. Okay, one more time. Can everyone, as, eh, though in North, we as free blacks are allowed to be more spoken about the abolish of slavery. On the other hand, the Southern free blacks are forced into silence into the shadows of not having a voice. In the North, in the, ah, ooh, I missed it. Where'd it go? Sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> oh, okay, we finished! <laughs>